Hello, welcome to another pen review. Uh, this time it's uh, not a fountain pen, it's actually a rollerball pen. Uh, it's this one here. It's a Piper by Franklin Christoph. Um, I'm not sure if they actually release these pens officially. Um, I believe they were demo versions that they did for a trial run. They're made out of acrylic blue um, setup. It's quite gorgeous. I'll show you in the uh, writing sample what that's like. But um, the finial is just a piece of shiny metal. On the other end, it's just the uh, blue acrylic. You've got a little uh, cap here, which does nothing. It's just a pretty silver ring. Silver ring in the middle, and uh, just there it says Piper across there. Um, it's got a nice shape um, clip. It's a very tight clip, but um, I found that the way it's shaped, it fits in perfectly in a uh, top pocket. Uh, I like the little cutout groove in the clip there. It's quite nice. It stands out. Makes it look a little bit different. Now, this is a very small pen. You ne I need to post it to be able to write it properly. If I just took a quick note, it'd be okay. But um, otherwise, it's just way too small. But it posts quite securely. Um, and then it turns it into a really nice sized pen. Um, I need to carry a ballpoint roller point at work due to using uh, carbon copy paper. And uh, this is my pen of choice. The acrylic is just gorgeous. Um, the refills are quite a standard refill. It's just typ typical, um, I think, Pilot Space Saver, I think they're called. Um, or this is the Piper brand itself. It just fits in. Uh, in this end, you have a spring. You just push the spring in. If you can find the hole. There we go. Just push it in, screw it on, and uh, away you go. So you can change these out for any colour you want. If you want a ballpoint or a roller ball, they both fit. Um, but yeah, so it's not too bad of a pen. Um, the dimensions for this pen are um, capped, it's 120 millimetres. Um, uncapped, it's uh, 116. Posted, it becomes a fairly decent 145 millimeters, which is quite nice. The um, grip section has a little bump here to stop your fingers from falling too far forward. But the uh, thinnest point of the grip section is 9 millimeters, with the barrel going up to 12 millimeters. Um, the weight with the pen cap attached is 22 grams, and the weight without is 15.2 grams. Um, I'll show you in the um, I'll show you up close what this uh, this uh, acrylic looks like, but it's quite gorgeous. It's a nice deep blue with um, sort of shiny bits in it. Um, you can, I believe they still have these on the Franklin Christoph website, and that they were done as a trial maybe. Uh, it wasn't too bad of a price, I just added it on, and um, I spent just enough money to get free shipping, so it was almost a free pen for me. But uh, I love this pen as a uh, ballpoint rollerball. And uh, yeah, all right, I'll um, show up close in a sec. All right, so here's the uh, Piper by um, Franklin Christoph. Um, here's the clip up close. It's a very nice clip. I'll see if I can get in this acrylic finish. You see how it changes a bit of color? It's got a metallic finish like that. Up in the clip, you can see it. This is a gorgeous looking pen. Um, the threads are really small, nothing to worry about, and uh, yeah, great little uh, ballpoint pen. Like I said it's gorgeous looking, so I recommend this pen if they've still got some available and you want one, snap yourself one up quick, otherwise they'll probably disappear as I believe they only produced a few of them. Alright, thanks for watching.